Just tonight at 530, we're learning more about a story we first reported on Friday. Only Eyewitness News was there as a car carrying a woman and three children was pulled from the Portsmouth Reservoir. That woman is now facing charges and today she went before a judge. Eyewitness News reporter Alexandra Leslie joins us now live in studio with the new details. Good evening. Well, Portsmouth police told us they believe 30 year old Amanda Nappy did this intentionally. In court today, police explained what she said on scene to lead them to that conclusion. After spending the weekend in jail, Amanda Nappy entered Newport District Court in handcuffs Monday. The 30 year old is accused of driving her car into the Lawton Valley Reservoir with her three children intentionally on Friday. In court Monday, Portsmouth Police Detective John Cahoon said a witness on scene saw the car go over the embankment. Police also say the witness told them fearing she would try to drown her children, they convinced her to get up onto the shore with them. We're told Nappy's three children are in the custody of the Massachusetts Department of Children and Families. The Milford Daily News reports the department also stepped in back in 2013 when Nappy was accused of causing a drunken disturbance in a local store while her one-year-old child was present. In court Monday, a judge set bail at $30,000 with surety, $10,000 for each felony count of cruelty to or neglect of a child. Nappy signed a waiver of extradition since she resides in Milford, Massachusetts. A no contact order with her three children was also put in place. And Nappy was referred to pretrial services for a mental health evaluation. She's due back in court in a few weeks. Live in studio tonight, I'm Alexandra Leslie, Eyewitness News.